Hello everyone, Jonathan Rayo here with Simplified Guitar. In this lesson, I'm gonna be teaching you how to play the Christmas song, Angels We Have Heard On High. So I'll go ahead and play the song for you first, and then afterwards, I'll break it down in more detail. Let's go ahead and get started. Angels we have heard on high Sweetly singing o'er the plain Mountains in reply, echoing their joyous strains. So for the verses of this song, I'm only playing two chords. I have the C chord and the G chord. Now when you're playing those two, it's nice to, be, to use this G because we have that same shape with our second and third finger. So all I need to do is take my first finger off, then take my second and third finger and shift them up a string each, and then I'm putting my pinky down on the last string, on the E string, third fret. Now when we get to the chorus of the song, it gets a little bit more complicated. We're throwing in a few more chords. So we're going from that C chord to an A minor seven, and all we gotta do for that is just pick up our third finger, and we're at the A minor seven. Then from there, we're going to a D minor, okay? And for that D minor, we need to bar the um, B and high E string with our first finger, and then place our second finger down on the second fret of the G string. And then from there, we're going to the G chord, then to the C chord, and then to F over C. Now you could play the traditional F if you want instead, uh, but this F over C is a nice fit in the C chord family. Um, it sounds really nice. You know, it, it has some similarities to that traditional C, uh, but it also makes transitioning a lot easier and you don't have to bar anything with your first finger. So all we're gonna do is from that C, we're just gonna take our pinky and put it down on the third fret of the D string, and then we're just gonna drop our second finger down a string, and that is your F over C. So it's a nice, easy transition from that C chord. For the strum pattern, we're using the folk pattern, which is a four beat strum pattern. We're gonna have four down strums with up strums added after beats three and four. We're also gonna just be plucking the first note of the chord for the first beat of each measure. So if I'm playing that C, the first note of that chord is gonna be on the A string, 
So the E string is not part of the C chord. So I'm gonna start my strumming there and I'm just plucking that string by itself for beat one. So again, we're gonna have one, two, three, and four, and 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 one. Anytime you have to start your strumming on anything other than that low E string, you might run into problems, you know, uh, keeping track of where your strumming hand is. One thing you can do is use your pinky as kind of like a guide or an anchor on the body of your guitar. And you just place it down there uh, and it'll be a good gauge for you to remember where you are. All right, if you'd like to get the chord chart for this song, just click on the link right here to head on over to the website where you can download that. If you enjoyed this lesson, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you can be notified when I come out with new lessons. All right, I hope to see you in the next one. Take care.